to do things. I think if we bring in computers to high school in every year, they'll um, people will learn a lot more instead of trying to cram information into us. There was a time when learning was about units of work. We studied the Trojans, we studied Romans, the Aztecs, space, dinosaurs. We took projects home and we burnt the edges for reasons I can no longer understand. But now, suddenly, content is so vast, we simply can't predict what new knowledge is going to come out, what knowledge young people will need to know in the future. So now we're saying to young people, it's far more important to learn to learn. It's not about the content, it's now about understanding how to learn. When I want to learn how to do a specific task, I'll go onto YouTube and find a tutorial that's been made by one of the various uploaders in the YouTube community. And sometimes they can be really helpful because there's many different people explaining it in different ways and instead of just getting one person's way of doing the task, you get many people's and you can find out for yourself which way is best suited for you. With all these global changes, suddenly we're having to change the way in which we teach our young people. They're moving into a world where we can't even predict their future. What they're going to need to know in the future is unknown. What they need to understand is unknown. So now we're moving from a historical body of knowledge we used to teach them to suddenly teaching them to be able to learn. They now have to become lifelong learners. And this is a different mode of education completely. So how do we prepare them for that? How do we prepare teachers to teach young people to be lifelong learners? To apprentice them and gradually build the capacity over years to become capable of managing their own learning and learning forever. Not only are we as teachers struggling with these changes in the world outside of our own world, but within our own world of education there are changes. We're now looking at far greater emphasis on teacher accountability. We're also looking at a new national curriculum. We're looking 